Hi, Geometry Kids. I wanted to go over a problem with you. This is number 22 on page 656 in your book. We have a radius drawn to a tangent segment. So we have a right angle right there. So what we're going to do is use the Pythagorean theorem. Leg squared plus leg squared equals hypotenuse squared to solve for the radius. Well, we have the radius here and here, but this little part over here is not the whole entire side of my triangle. So that's, this is what I have to be careful about. The legs of the triangle are r and 9. So I can fold that straight into here. r squared plus 9 squared equals the hypotenuse is this whole segment here. So that is 6 plus r, or r plus 6. So when I go to plug it in over here, I need parentheses around the r plus 6. Just like what we did in class the other day, we're going to have to FOIL over here on the right side. So the left side is r squared plus 81, 9 times 9 is 81. Over here, I'm going to write out r plus 6 times another r plus 6 because that's what it means when you square something, you multiply it by itself. Now I'm going to use FOIL on the right side here. So I've got r squared plus 81 on the left, and over here on the right, first terms multiplied together, r squared, outside terms multiplied together, plus 6r, inside terms, 6 times r, so we have another 6r, and the last term, 6 times 6, or 36. So let's combine like terms on the right side. So I have r squared plus 81 equals r squared plus these two combined for 12r plus 36. Now I'm ready to start canceling things and finally solving for r. Just like the problem we did in class the other day, both sides have an r squared, so I can cancel those out. And that leaves me with 81 equals 12r plus 36. Then you want to subtract 36 from each side. 81 minus 36 is 45 equals 12r. And then I divide both sides by 12. And I get r equals 45 over 12. I know you can use your calculator and give me a decimal. So let's try to reduce it as a fraction. What number goes into both 45 and 12? 3. So 45 divided by 3 is 15. And 12 divided by 3 is 4. So the best way to write our answer here is 15 fourths. 